here I am with my Pellet Pro 2 from 1990. This is a beautiful stove, it's all cast iron. It's got a beautiful three part ceramic base and it is burning Termin pellets. I'm set at uh, number two. And you can see just a gorgeous, gorgeous flame there on that Pellet Pro 2. Now I gotta be honest with you, I just got a new computer board and the secondary board because the primary input to the power burnt the board out after <laughs> it's 2018. How many years is that? Almost 20. Now, this stove, after the install of those two boards and a cleaning of both the combustion motor and the exhaust fan motor is absolutely extraordinary. Look at that firebox. Yeah, this is a 1990 Pellet Pro 2. You can't go wrong with the stove. Then this is 55,000 BTUs. Cost of uh, operation, maybe seven bucks a day. I'm burning about a bag and a quarter, bag and a half a day on number two setting. I don't even know where my uh, pusher block setting is. Four and a half turns out, something like that. That's about what they recommend. I don't even tinker with it. The first year I got it, five years ago, I was messing with this thing all the time. Once I got the pusher block set up, four and a half, five turns out whatever size pellets. I'm always burning Termin. I've done Lignetics. They don't really push the heat out like this does. Termin is just reliable. So now I'm going to shut up and you can hear this fan cycling. Now there's an ESP probe in the back of the exhaust and it works impeccably to sense exhaust temperature and it tells the feeder when to feed and it tells the blower motor how much pressure to push out you know, that bed of coals right there. Amazing. 1990. I was in 11th grade in 1990 and someone was building a beautiful engineered stove like this. Absolutely fantastic. Let's listen to the Harman Pellet Pro 2. Yeah, see? You just shut down and you're going to notice those coals going less red. The flame changes color just a little bit. Now in a second or two you're going to hear the feed motor kick on. Drop a few more pellets in. The auger is going to push them out. See? Next you're going to hear the fan kick on higher and the auger come out at the same time to give it more fuel. Let's keep listening. You're going to notice that bed of ambers is going to blow up. It's going to get white hot. Let's keep watching. baby the pellet pro 2 I'm telling you I don't even understand why they need to make a better stove why does everything have to be new and improved this thing is the bomb I'm telling you 55,000 BTUs 55,000 and I'm probably running at two I can't even imagine that whole entire uh, burn pot being filled up with coals this thing would be smoking my entire house out this room right now is 80 degrees and it's 7 degrees outside on uh, January 5th, 2018. So, for all you folks out there thinking about getting a different Pellet Pro or a P68 or P61 or P43, P38, Bands, etc. Look for one of these Pellet Pro 2s online. You might even be able to buy this one from me for about 900 bucks. Who knows? I don't know. I might sell it. Anyway, thanks for watching. Pellet Pro 2 Harmon 1990. Signing off. Look at that flame. Oh my gosh.